begins with breaking news. And we do begin with breaking news here out of Santee, where a bomb threat was called in at West Hills High School. 10 News reporter Ashley DiMartino is at the school right now. Ashley, what have you learned? Well, we just arrived a few moments ago. The school itself is on lockdown. There's a heavy presence of sheriffs that are here and even all the way down the street. You can see they have the school buses lined up at this point to be able to evacuate the students from campus. Here's the information that we have learned from the sheriff's department. They say that at around 915 this morning, a call came in to 911 and uh, was a young man apparently saying he was sick of being bullied and that he had placed four bombs in separate bags in various spots uh, across the campus. Sheriff's deputies immediately came here. They have had their bomb squad here. They've also had their bomb sniffing dogs um, uh, throughout the campus. They have told us that they have found two backpacks, one outside the library, one that is outside the aquatic center right now. They also said they found a few suspicious packages that are in other locations on campus. Now again, the school is on lockdown. They're going to begin to evacuate students uh, very soon. Uh, they do tell us uh, that uh, concerned parents can go to the Pathway Church parking lot. That's where they're going to be taking the students to. But at this point, the investigation into these suspicious boxes and backpacks that have been found in various locations across the campus is continuing right now. And again, heavy sheriff's presence that is here. The school currently on lockdown. Uh, we also know that the young juvenile said that the bombs would explode within 20 minutes, but that time has come and gone, the sheriff's department tells us. We're going to continue to monitor this situation, bring you the latest details throughout the newscast. For now, we are live at West Hills High School. Ashley DiMartino, 10 News.